morning guys okay so i've literally just got 10 minutes i know every single time i come on this vlog i'm like i've literally got 10 minutes but i'm about to leave i'm going to london today we're going for a concert so it's currently 8 30 and my train is at 9 30 so i need to get the bus to the train station okay so who am i gonna go see do i reveal it now or do i wait <laughs> okay i'm gonna reveal it now so it's an afrobeat artist i don't know if you've heard him some of you might some of you might not but he's the african giant so i think that should give you a clue if you don't know he's called banner boy i'm gonna insert his picture somewhere here and basically what happened was so his tickets got released like last year or something and my friend joy called me and was like oh my god she's a fan of banner boy and she wants to go to his concert and whatever so we decided to buy the tickets after the tickets got released so i got the tickets since last year november i don't know if i've said this in any of my previous vlogs because i don't really talk about this much because obviously it's so far away so we got the tickets we booked our hotel and everything and oh my god i did not even tell you the story about the tickets right so i was meant to get the tickets like 7 to 14 days before the event so 14 days to the event i'm like okay cool they said 7 to 14 days so i'm just gonna wait till like later so tell me why it's now five days to the event and i still haven't gotten like an email confirmation about my tickets being released and so now i started panicking so i texted not texted so i emailed the people and was like you know what i forgot my ticket you lot said 7 to 14 days before the event and then he, the guy was like okay wait till like thursday morning if you haven't received the ticket then you come back and we'll try and sort it out for you mind you the concert is on the saturday so he's telling me that by thursday morning i should get the tickets so thursday morning so wednesday comes in no ticket thursday morning comes in no ticket now it's thursday afternoon and i'm like oh my god now it's evening time and i'm like um so then um so obviously when the tickets didn't come in on the thursday morning i did send them an email but i didn't hear a reply back and then afternoon nothing and then i sent a last email around like 5 p.m but i didn't hear nothing from them back the whole day and then i was on a call with one of my friends and i was like oh my god the ticket hasn't arrived yet i'm panicking like i booked the tickets you know like if you book the tickets it's a bit weird if you don't have tickets you know what i mean so i was like oh my god like i'm anxious i'm nervous like are we still going so i legit clocked out I was like you know what i'm not even getting the tickets like we're not going like allergic clock towel so i didn't even buy a dress or like an outfit for the concert so i just literally have to pair up anything so if i'm looking bummy tomorrow just know that's because i did not plan for this event at all like i had literally clock time in my mind i was like you know what i'm not going but yeah so then friday morning i wake up and then i saw an email from them apparently the tickets go released around like so I wake up in the morning on a Friday and then I check my emails and then I actually got an email back and it was like, oh, your tickets have been released. And then the email was sent at like half seven last night. So obviously I didn't see it and I was panicking the whole evening. But yeah, so we're going to the concert. I know I've been rumbling on and on and on and on right now, but we're going to the concert. My hair is looking so bummy. I was meant to do my hair yesterday, like do it properly and make the curls come out. But it is what it is at this point like it is what it is okay i let you slept at 1am last night i don't know what i was doing don't ask me what i was doing okay because i don't even know what i was doing but then the time just flew like honestly also ignore the background i know it's a bit of a mess but yeah so i'm already prepped and packed so ignore the dish as well guys <laughs> oh my god like we all have our days okay and this is one of them days okay okay right so i'm all prepped and packed now so i'm gonna go so before i forget a little ootd moment so i'm wearing this skim strip top and then i'm wearing these trousers i'm wearing these long ass boots not by choice because this is what i'm gonna wear into the concert so i just decided to pop this on the trousers are so long by the way if you haven't realized i'll see you guys at the train station like i'm so tired like i literally just got to travel lodge and tell me why it's telling me reception is closed and now i need to ring the number 
oh my god it's so damn warm outside honestly i love the weather so much it's so warm so that's one good thing but yeah i need to bring the reception because i have early check-in so i need to do my nails and then i'll also have to do my makeup and then my friend is gonna come and so then we're gonna go have some breakfast but i also need to bring my sister first because she's also coming to the banner boy concert so you know we would have to meet up and stuff like that i am so tired okay i am literally so exhausted I can finally relax. Also, I need to take a pee and a big fat. <laughs> I don't even know if this is appropriate to see on camera right now. But yeah, uh, uh, we're in the room. I'm actually stood in front of my door. I'm not gonna show you the number because privacy reasons. I mean, to be fair, you're not gonna be seeing this video until. So I'll just show you the number anyway. Okay, let me give you a quick room tour. We've just got the bed, a TV, windows, art um, a little dress up table here some mirror some hangers extra pillows bathroom just a plain shower sink me that's it also my friend just came in so i need to go pick her up so i'm just gonna pick her up now and then you're gonna meet joy for the second time so if you don't know joy was on my first ever vlog that i uploaded onto youtube which was like a london vlog so we went to wireless and stuff so yeah you're gonna meet joy again so come along this is actually the first time ever that i'm wearing fake um false nails really? no it's really yeah the only the most i've done is put on gel Really? Yeah, I've never worn press-ons. I've never been bothered because I've always thought oh, I was just gonna come off. No, I just thought I just haven't been bothered because <laughs> I thought it would take ages, but it doesn't take long. Yeah, it doesn't. It's literally like ten seconds of putting each one. <laughs> I got makeup on my shirt. I'm all done now. My nails still need to be fake, but that'll take me like two minutes today. And yeah, let me show you the OOT. So I'm wearing this white top. Got it for my mom. Some mini skirts. Don't know if you can see it. Then the same boots. So counts down we've literally just got two hours i think to the concert we're gonna be queuing up for so long because i know there's gonna be thousands of people so we're going to the london stadium we're gonna get something to eat first oh yeah i forgot to introduce you to um joy so one hey. minute hey for the camera this light the lighting here is so bad like honestly yeah, it's literally it the worst thing well i need to put my earrings on i just got this cute dress on with the belt y2k it's getting y2k uh, and i'm trying to put these earrings on and it's impossible do you want me to pop them on for you yes please did you get another ear piercing uh i got these in september oh yeah we haven't seen each other since last year oh yeah no. since leeds concert no. and festival and then I got my nose. Yeah, that has been like a year already. Yeah, it's crazy. And we don't even speak all the time either. No. Oh, Joy sat on the floor. Yeah. <laughs> what <In> you... space. <laughs> okay, so we're just about to do my nails, and then I think that's it for my getting ready. Oh yeah, let me show you what nails I'm using as well. So I've got these like French tip press-ons. So I'm just gonna pop these on. In shoes, New Balance online somewhere. Jewelry from Nevea and earrings, um, Dubai somewhere. Up from mom. <laughs> Necklace from mom. Boots from Ego. Things a bit from everywhere. Charity shops, vintage, everywhere. And yeah, I think that's it. Yeah, my uh, earrings voice. from my sister. These are from my mom. 
Okay, so we're famished. We made a bunch of TikToks. We tried to do uh, the, uh, you know, the Tyler dance. It was horrendous. <laughs> Can I put it in the video? <laughs> yeah, <sure. laughs> okay, I'll put it up there somewhere. <laughs> it's so hilarious. But yeah, we're gonna go have some food. We're craving some Chinese. So we'll see you at the Chinese place. Bye. Oh, also these are my nails, so. And mine. Talking to your phone like five minutes straight. I think, yeah, we were outside. We did OOTDs as well. Mm. <laughs> yeah, I didn't post that. I did that. No, I didn't. I only posted the wireless one. Oh, you do have a YouTube channel? Yeah, I do. Am I on it? You're on the first video. I need to see it. What's it called? I need to own it. <laughs> it is. <laughs> What's wrong with that name? Nothing, but I just, I haven't told people <laughs> that I have it. No, um, Fez. That's why I never knew. Well, duh. I mean, you knew. I, I did say I was going to put it on my YouTube last year, but I never told you I actually did put it on. Yeah, but what if you just said that? I mean, you just keep it on your camera or like, that way. You could have done that. I could, yeah, true. Yeah. What do you mean you have 15k? You have 15k already? Really? Did we hit 15k? No, almost. What do you mean you have 49,000 subscribers? Huh? You have 49,000 subscribers. Yeah, but you're not on my channel. Yeah, I'm not on your channel. Oh my god, it's so cloudy. Anyways, we're currently on our way to London Stadium. Going to Westfield right now. How are you feeling about the concert? I'm feeling excited because we're going to see Bad Boy in person. I haven't seen him in person yet, so I'm looking forward to it. So we need to walk about 20 minutes to get there. So I think I'll see you guys when I get there. I know this vlog is all over the place, but... Wait, have you still got your chicken in your bag? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, but by the time we get there, I'll be hungry, so... I've got mine as well. I don't think I'll have it though, but... Yeah, Okay, so it's the day after the concert and I'm going to do a debrief later, but we're going to go get some seafood today. I've had enough one. I was going to say. You're in 4K. <laughs> Every two minutes vlog. You just want to enjoy the moment sometimes, but nah, she needs to vlog it. Some people are built for social media. Uh, help me. You know what, I need to inspire me. I want to put on a chain thing now. Mm. 
Okay, so yeah, that's about that. Just the haters. You know, the haters are always gonna hate, and she's in the <laughs> she's in the mirror behind me right now. Anyways, OOTD. For some reason, we're all twinning today, which is weird. But I'm wearing this top. I got it from TikTok shop. I've had these trousers for years now, and I'm wearing the boots from ego because i can't be asked to pack the boots since we've only been here a night i'm gonna turn the camera about and then they're gonna do their ootds although they don't want to i'm gonna force them to do their ootds and i mean someone that's right there yeah um, you top from top from top shop travels from top shop she's just a normal new balances and that's it bag bags for bow and tea passport bags I forgot where my top is from. <laughs> Can someone check the label? <laughs> <laughs> really have to. Let me. Yeah. Things we do for Anita. Zara. Okay, okay, I'll do my OTD. Uh, top from Zara. Jeans Monkey. from Monkey. Yeah, you know, you know. Um, watch okay. Timu. Rings. These are the same rings. I'm wearing the same jewelry I wore yesterday. Oh yeah. Rings from Nivea. And uh, shoes, New Balance. Bear in mind for every time in the gym. So it looks like crusty, but it does the job. I need to get another one. You also look fine. I think it's just, you can tell when they're old because that turns gray, doesn't it? Yeah. yeah. I think ever since I washed it, these are so comfy as well, you oh know? Oh my goodness, yeah. It goes with everything. Fly. Yeah, it, it does. goes with everything. Because before it used to be Air Forces, but yeah. these ones. Yeah. I've never thought that Air Forces would go out of fashion, but they actually are out of fashion. Not great. I think these, because these are trending, that's why. Mm. I guess it's just because you don't see Air Forces posted yeah. everywhere, but people still wear them. But these are the most comfiest trainers. Oh, time to go. <laughs> we just had a knock. We were meant to check out at 12 and it's literally like 12 20. So, oopsies. Oopsies. I'm all packed, yes. as you can see. Okay. Are you guys excited for um, no, seafood no, no, boil? No. Yeah, yeah we're just coming up now. Yeah. Are you guys excited yeah, for to, seafood boil? Yeah. Anita, all we need to do is leave here. <laughs> Fine, I'll ask them later on. But yeah, see you. <laughs> Why are you irritated me? <laughs> <laughs> excited for um, seafood because I haven't tried seafood before have you I've never had seafood before I was the one who suggested this even yeah she did so I'm excited to try it I'm a seafood one yeah oh have you tried it before yeah, when ah. <laughs> I hope it's nice though because I've seen like a lot of videos on TikTok and it looks so good but then I don't want to get disappointed you know what I mean yeah, same. I was just thinking about all the Americans you see who have it and they like take, take out the bag and steam it. Yeah, that's what I want to have, so. Yeah, so we're currently walking to the shell, apparently, I think that's what it's called. And that was the only seafood bowl we could find at the minute, so we're currently walking there. We've had to take two trams there, so hopefully it's good because I'm going to be irritated if it's not, consider what happened to me yesterday with my crispy noodles. I'm gonna give you this, the rundown tomorrow or sometime when I'm editing the video, but it was the worst. It was the worst. Do you wanna tell them what happened? So basically, she ordered crispy stir fried noodles on the menu. And you think, when you see crispy noodles, you're like, oh yeah, okay. So the meat and the vegetables, those would be the crispy part. But no, bro, the <laughs> noodles were crispy and they weren't even cooked. They took out the pack and they put it in the back. I know. They, 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 <laughs> apparently, they took it out of the pack and then they fried it. Like, imagine frying a noodle that's out of the pack. Or maybe I'm just uncultured. 
and I don't know about it, but like. And then when like we asked um, if the food can be changed, they said no. Fair enough. They said because it's already cooked. But it's not cooked. <laughs> And then she asked them if they could put it in water to boil. <laughs> and they basically said, take this food, go home and cook it yourself. <laughs> and then you kept making fun of me the whole time. It was so funny at the no, time. No, it wasn't because I was so hungry as well. That was so funny. And then I was so excited to have my food and then it just came and I was like, the what good the heck? The thing about the place is their portion sizes were massive. So I ordered rice. I ordered egg fried rice and black bean sauce with seafood and like the portions were enough for two people they were so big so, yeah so i had some of her yeah food. she had half of mine actually Not just, half. yeah you had half of the rice less than half but it's fine because the rice was enough for two people or more than enough for two people yeah Oof. so hopefully what happened yesterday doesn't happen to me today okay so fingers crossed but i'm really really excited to try it so i'll see you when we get there I was like, permit, thank you. You're good, uh. Yeah. <laughs> something for something. Let's go for one, for two, for three. This is what you call obsession. To the tea. We've made that one still. Thank you. No How does it feel to not be able to get the meat out of the lobster? Mm. Asking for professional. <laughs> <laughs> I like to have experiences. <laughs> <laughs> it's when you were grabbing that fish. But you did not catch that one. I did. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what? And that ended. Do you know what she caught? I was doing this, yeah. She put it on the camera. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> Like the ones I see on online, they put some tomato, some sauce. Yeah, yeah they die. Did you, did you I think you have to buy it. What? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, from below here. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> <laughs>